What up, y'all? It's your girl, Miss Melissa, here on New York's premier hip-hop and R&B program, XTV, and I'm here with the star himself, Tyrese. How you doing? What's up, baby girl? All right. Now, for a lot of you guys who don't know, he's here to promote a new album, a double album, actually, that he has come out in December. But I'm going to let him tell himself about it more. Um, for all my fans out there who's been frustrated at me, I've been getting the emails and the letters about when am I going to put another album out, it's here. The album is coming out December 12th. I know I've been out doing a bunch of films, and I appreciate y'all for always going out to support me and my many different ventures, but um, I'm back. It's a double album, so I'm going to give y'all more than enough to listen to. And um, I've been going through a lot of changes, spiritually, internally, creatively. And I feel like I'm, I'm, I've been liberated. I'm at, I'm at my creative peak, so to speak. So it's a double album. One whole side is the R&B that y'all are used to. And I, I anticipate my fans going out to support that. And then the other side is Black Tie. This character, my AKA Black Tie. So um, it's coming out on December 12th. And don't worry, it's not gonna be double priced. Um, they set it up to where they're selling two two albums at the price of one, so it's going to be uh, it's going to be special for everybody. All right, now your alter ego is Black Tie. What makes him different from the Tyrese that we all know? Um, I feel like me as a singer, even though I love my R&B fans, there's only so much I can sing about. Okay. Um, I can switch it up and do a bunch of different creative type of R&B records, but I choose to not want to sing about the streets choose to not try and portray any type of thug, gangster, anything on, on you know, in the R&B aspect. I want to sing about love, I want to sing about romance and, and the bedroom and things that, you know, I'm supposed to be singing about. Because that's the direction my R&B career went in. Uh, but Black Tie is able to say things and talk about things and, and do records about things that Tyrese would never be able to. All right, so now, you was on the radio show the other day when they were talking about you and your rapping career and all that, and I believe it was Funkmaster Flex who gave you the respect and credit because, unlike a lot of other people in the industry who don't take the time out to promote themselves, you are actually active in these, handing out your own CDs, weren't you? Yeah, that's all I do, you know what I'm saying? All of these mixtapes right here, it's uh, over 450,000 of these have been downloaded on my website, headquarterentertainment.com. And I got 20,000 of these printed up, my own money. I've been printing up my own snipes. I've been out in clubs, hand to hand and everybody. Because for me, you know, I'm introducing people to another side. And they like to believe because you're a much bigger star than a lot of these people out here running around, that you should consider yourself too big and too above everybody to be in the streets, hand to hand, and people trying to introduce you to another side. But for me, you know, how can I expect people to support and get behind this movement if I'm not going to put a personal touch on it. I can easily afford 50 street teams. I got the money to do it. But a street team is not going to be able to, to, you know, expose my fans who know me from doing one thing to the other side the way I feel like I can. And then plus when people meet me from actually handing the CD out, they're like, well, why'd you choose to do hip hop, man? Why'd you decide now to put out, put out a rap album? And I say them, you know, I used to be in a rap group called Triple Impact yeah, long I before I started know singing. They didn't know before. Yeah, yeah, because I'm not known as an MC. You know what I'm saying? I'm known as a singer. So for me, I got to let people know that there's a lot of rappers out there singing right now. And who's to say that because they were exposed to the world as an MC first, that they had they ain't been dealing with the, the struggles of wanting to sing. You know what I'm saying? No pun intended, but you look at Pharrell, you look at Nelly out with a duet with Janet Jackson, you look at, uh, you know, a bunch of different cats out there. Who's to say that these guys wasn't in choirs before they decided to be a rapper? You know what I'm saying? So I look at them and I say, you know what, I respect y'all for getting it out because you should never stifle yourself cre you know, creatively. You should just let it out because people got these 10 year and 15 year plans, but these natural disasters are happening every day, man. So tomorrow's no guarantee. So Black Tie is in the building, and I'm here to stay. Now you have a lot of features on the album. Who is the person that you love to work with the most? I can't say that I love working with one particular person. Uh, 
to be honest, because no two experiences have been the same. I can say that um, I had more fun working on this album than I've ever done. It should almost be illegal for me to make money on this album from how much fun I had making this album. All right, so how can your fans get in touch with you? Because, you know, like the MySpace thing is going crazy. I know you got your own website or whatever. Yeah. So how can they get in touch with you? They can you? go to MySpace slash Tyrese. Okay. Um, or they can uh, go to this website. This is the most important spot here. Because you go to this website, you'll be able to download Ghetto Royalty. You got Cassidy, Memphis Bleak, David Banner, Corrupt, Eric Sermon, Stevie Wonder, all on the mixtape with me. It's called Ghetto Royalty, hosted by DJ SMS. And, um, you know, you'll be able to just check out what I'm coming with as an MC. And uh, you also can download Black Tie featuring Jay-Z and Pac called 1900 Black Tie. You'll also be able to download my first single on the hip-hop side called Get It In. Black Tie featuring Method Man produced by Scott Storch. And you'll be able to download my first single on the R&B side called One produced by the Underdogs. And I'm to see person, will that be? I'm on a 35 city tour now, okay. um, and it's called the Alter Ego Black Tour, so the concept is if I'm in this city, you, you, you can't get in unless you got on black, and I'm looking at it as a, a performance slash listening part, because I want my fans to hear the kind of records that I'm coming with on this new album. Alright, y'all, what's your girl, Miss Melissa on XTV, your boy Tyrese, and we out of here. It's your man, Black Tie.